Boo Boo, you started to sell a little bit about Wyoming. And what, what have you seen on film? We see the numbers and they're running up and down the field and scoring points. What have you guys seen? Seen a lot of, they run a lot of spread offense and tricky offense. They like to move the ball around the field, run it, pass it a lot. What's it going to take then for you guys to, I don't know if stop it is the goal, maybe slow it down is the goal? Get them to our speed, get up, get lined up, play play our football, not their football, play our defense, and execute the game plan. But what have you heard about Greg Brandon, and what's it kind of like to know that a former BG coach is standing on the other sidelines? Say so, uh, he, he can get a team fired up, and he's a real tricky coach. He likes to do a lot of trick plays, so respected a lot of trick plays from him, and he's a, he's a good coach. Google, will you talk a little bit about yourself here? What's what's the difference you see in your game last year and this year? Mm, I'm more vocal. Uh, I like to talk a lot on the field, get my uh, teammates more hype to play at a high level. Mm, more of a leader. I like playing at a high level. So, is that I mean, is that a function of being on the field more or being more comfortable? Second year in the program, or what, why? How, how is this developed? Both well, being on the field and being comfortable with the program. So yeah, being on the field a lot, I'm more comfortable with the playbook. I know what I'm doing, and more experience. What's the vibe like around the team compared to this time last year when you were 0-2? You're 2-0. You had the great crowd here on Saturday night. What's it like going into this third game? Uh, we're, we're very, we're very anxious to play this game to see how the crowd gonna turn out. We really happy. 2-0, good start off. Trying to make it 3-0. Team ain't started 3-0 since 2003, I believe. And the locker room is very great, so a lot of atmosphere. Are you guys surprised by this start, or did you expect to be 2-0 at this point? I don't see much surprise. I mean, we put in a lot of work in the winter, in the summer, so we came ready. Yeah, I've got to ask about this nickname. Where did this come from? Where, how did you get to be Boo Boo? Well, my aunt, I'm, I'm from Texas. My aunt came to Texas, and she didn't like the name Jerry. And she said, I did something. <laughs> So she just said boo boo, and that's been my nickname ever since. How did you react when you got called boo boo for the first time? I mean, I guess. Mm -hmm. How's your aunt, huh? Yeah, so just, uh, I guess I go by it now. Everybody called me, so it's kind of fine. Do you take much grief on the field for that kind of nickname? I mean, it's not rock or anything like that. I mean, do you take grief for it? Nah, this is cool. <laughs> I, I also saw you run on the field with a baseball bat. But can you kind of tell me what that was up? Yeah, uh, for our, our special team, our special teams coach got a, uh, we got two awards now. It's a hard hat for the, the most hard working uh, special teams player, uh, our four special teams. And then a the bat is for the hardest hit out of the four special teams. And in Idaho, I had, the, I had the hardest hit on kickoff. So I was awarded a bat for that game. Wasn't that the hit on the very first play of the game? No, it was a hit in the, the, the second kickoff. Second, yeah, second kickoff. Okay. We, and you also had a pretty big one on Saturday. I mean, yeah, that was that was that earned me the bat again, so I have, I have it this <laughs> week. So, so you just got your name on the bat? Yeah, I got on there twice. Will you talk a little bit about making those big plays on special teams? A lot of guys, it's I play offense, I play defense, I don't play special teams. Yeah, special teams is fun. It's it's more like run out there and have fun. So when I'm running down on kickoff, when I'm running, I'm scanning and seeing, then I see the ball carrier make his move, then I make my move. And then when I hit him, I just lay out and just see what happens. You talked a little bit about your role on offense on special teams returning kickoffs. What's that like for you? Yeah, I, um, I have a role of off returner. So I'm, I'm net, uh, I'm blocked first before I return the kickoff until they start kicking me the ball. So my position is really an unselfish position. So I like to block for Stevie Dunlap, which is our, our main returner, to get him to the end zone. Anything else?
Thanks. Thank you.